Hello everyone, welcome once again to Saga's Online Mask. Let's solve this question together. Now we're going to 3 multiplied by s to the power of s equals to what? 3 raised to the power of what? s plus 10. We are asked to find the value of s. This question is very, very simple, very, very simple to solve. Now let's solve it together. Now our first step, what we're going to do is to divide both sides by what? By 3. That's our first step. Let's divide both sides by 3. So if we divide here by 3, and divide here by what? 3. Okay. We know that this thing will go out, right? So we are left with what? S to the power of what? X equals to. Now, by one of the law of indices, since we have a division sign here, right? This base, you can see this, this is the base and this is the exponent. And this is the base and the power here is 1. Okay? So this is 10 as what? 3S to the power of 10. 3 is for what? 3 is the power what? 3 is the power what? X plus 10, then minus 1. Because when the base are the same, we subtract the index, that's why we are subtracting, you can see we have a minus 1 here. Now, now this is what, s to the power what, s equals to what, 3 raised to the power what, x, then plus 1 plus 9, okay? Because 10 minus 1 is 9. Now, what are we going to do here? Now, we know that by one of the law of indices, that we can also see this as what, s to the power of s is equal to 3 raised to the power of x, multiplied by what, 3 raised to the power of what, 9. Now, one of the law of indices, they are the same thing, because... Since the base are the same, we can add the exponents as you can see here. Now, what we are going to do is to divide both sides by what? By 3, 3 is 4 of x. So, we divide here by what? 3 is 4 of x. And we divide here by what? 3 is 4 of what? x. Okay? Now, see that this, we can also add this. Okay? So, now see that s to the power of x divided by what? 3 is 4 of x is equal to what? 3 is 4 of what? 9. Okay? So, what are we going to do here? What we are going to do here? Observe very well. Since the argument as the power is common, as the power are common. You can write this as into s divided by 3 all is for what s is equals to what 3 raised to the power of 9. Because this power is affecting both s and affecting both 3 because they are having a common of what power. Now, look at what I was going to do. Let's concentrate as on the right hand side. We are having 3 raised to the power of 9. Do you know that 3 raised to the power of 9 is equal to into, uh, into what 9 divided by 3 raised to the power of what 9. They are the same thing because 9 divided by 3 is still 3. And the power here is still 9. You know, so in place of this, we can also write it this way. So now this is what? Into s divided by 3 raised to the power of s is equal to into 9 divided by what? 3 raised to the power of what? 9. They are the same thing. Now let's check by comparing. Consider that power here is s and the power here is 9. What you're having here is s and what you're having here is 9. They are the same method is the same. So we can see that by comparing, by com what? Comparing. By comparing, right? We we'll see that by comparing that x, let me remove this, that x, that s is equal to what? 9. That's the value of s. Let's see from s divided by 3 is equal to what? 9 divided by what? 3. Okay? Now you can see that from here that s here, s is equal to 9. Okay? But let's make it for a clear a clarification. Let's multiply 3 times s equals 3x, okay? Equals to 3 times 9 equals what? 27. So if we divide here by 3, and also divide here by what? 3. 3 will go, then our s also equals to what? 9. So when s equals to 9 is the only solution to this particular problem. So thank you so much for watching. Please, if you find it interesting, don't hesitate. Like, comment, also share to loved ones or others who learn from it. Thank you so much, and God bless you. Bye.